got, I got, I got, I got loyalty, got royalty inside my DNA. Cocaine quarter piece, piece got war and peace inside yo what's up everybody man it's your boy sean be nice back again with y'all some more daily tech news i'm really gave i'm here, really here to give you guys my opinion on the pics too as far as how they are with the display and everything and the kind of the issues that they're having right now man and, and i really think it's because they're trying so hard to follow in apple steps i think they're missing out on a lot of things that shouldn't even be an issue you know what i mean at this point in the game with the success of the pixel you guys bringing out a pixel 2 you know having display issues should shouldn't even be the case and i'm wondering now you know what i'm saying this is this is definitely this is, there's no fact with this but i'm wondering because they got their screens from lg and lg you know screens honestly you know the lg v30 screen isn't like super good but i'm wondering man if lg was like yeah we hook you guys up with some displays and when they hooked them up with the displays it wasn't that good you know what i mean like they hit them up with like some cheap mediocre displays because they knew their phone was coming out so i don't think lg is going to give them the same display or the best display that they have to go to like a competitor you know, i just don't see them doing that you know what i mean but like what do you what do you guys think do you think that lg will purposely sabotage uh, the the pixel device so they can so they can ensure that their phone will be the top seller and the best the best on the market I mean, I, I would hope they wouldn't do something like that, but you you never know with these companies. And for the Pixel really not to be, I don't really feel like they doing enough in their power to be really addressing this issue, especially seeing how that, you know, this is their bread and butter right now. And they're trying to make their self really known with their phones on the, on the market. You know, it's, it's just not a good look. I feel like honestly, Google just in general focuses more on software versus hardware. And, and I've had this debate with some of the guys in the the late the, the tech live talk the the live tech talk show that I do, and we kind of you know we we all came to that conclusion a little bit that maybe Google is more so focused on software versus hardware, and even if you look at Jerry Riggs everything, he was able to bend the pixel with little to no effort, and I don't see how that's the case. Like if you, you guys been making, I mean. The Nexus phone, like, yes, this is like the first time, like only the second generation of the Pixels phone, right? But you guys, have, you know, you guys, you, you make the Nexus phone. So why is it so hard now for you guys to make a, a, a great solid phone without display issues, without any, all these other issues? Like it shouldn't be that hard. And and, and I, I feel like they, they have no excuse, man. I, I really do. I already feel like they just, they missed the ball with this one, man. And it's like, if you guys are gonna come out with a second generation phone, you guys definitely wanna have no issues as far as uh, display issues of concern or the phone being, you know, easily breakable, things of that nature. That should not be the case. Your, your second phone should always be your best phone. Um, you know, pretty much an improvement on the first generation. And, and I don't even think they did that, to be honest with you. That's why I'm not, honestly, I'm not grabbing the Pixel 2. I'm not reviewing that phone. I'm not doing anything with that phone at all. So my, my goal, honestly, is to just like let that phone go. If my subscribers really want to see it, maybe I could think of something. Maybe I might get it. But as far as like for personal use, I don't want that phone. Um, and, it's, and it's mainly not because of the display issue. I know all phones are going to have issues, but it's more so that the fact that you know, one, you only put on a Verizon wireless. Yeah, I don't, I don't understand why you guys keep doing that. And it's the same thing that Apple did with their phones, right? When the first mm -hmm. iPhone came out, they put it on AT&T for like a couple of years first. Um, I don't know why they did that. And now you have, even though you can buy the Pixel Unlock, I know you can buy the phone unlock, but you're only putting on Verizon as far as carry is concerned. And it's like, well, I don't want it on Verizon. And I, and I don't, you know, I don't even think it's gonna work well on like Sprint or anything like that. I know you can take the phone to T-Mobile, but, but there are other carriers, you know what I mean? Like why put your consumers in a box like that? So now you put me in a box on which carrier I should have because most most people are not gonna go out and spend a thousand dollars on a pixel, especially having display issues and especially if they're worried about the phone breaking. They're not gonna go out and spend a thousand dollars on this. Now they may be more open to do it if they can get it subsidized, right? They could buy it on their own carrier like T Mobile, Sprint or pay your monthly payments of like $25 or $30 a month, then okay. But now you want me to sit there and pay $1,000 for a phone that's gonna have a display issue that could be easily be broken with little to no effort? I don't think so. So um, uh, Pixel, Google, I hope you're hearing this, man. Fix your phones. Open your phone up to other carriers than just Verizon. And you know, Verizon's not even a top carry anymore. You know, you got T Mobile's out there doing that thing, grabbing all these new subscribers to their to their uh to their platforms and their network, 
and you just keep putting up a rise, I just think that's just a dumb move, man. But let me know what you guys think in the comment section. You know, am I, am I tweaking that, you know, maybe that the pixel is not, the display isn't as bad as, you know, they're claiming it to be. Um, do you think that the pixel should continue to just put their phones on a rise until at least they figure out how to actually fix their problems with their phones? Maybe, maybe it's a reason why they're not putting on other carriers. Maybe they're not ready for mass production. Who knows? But let me know what you comment, what you guys think in the comment section below, man. Please like the video, share it. If you didn't like the video, please hit the thumbs down. Let me know what you didn't like about it. Maybe it was the game I was playing. I don't know. But you know what I'm saying? Just, commu just communicate with your boy, man. I'm, I'm open. I'll talk to all my subscribers in the comment section and, and everything. You know what I'm saying? It's your boy, Sean. Be nice. And I'm out. Deuces.